back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a clothing haul for you. There's quite a lot to go through, so I'm going to try and make it as quick as possible. I don't want to bore you guys to death. Also, if you hear snorting, that isn't me. That is Jerry in the room. We're in the house on our own and he doesn't like to be on his own. So he's in here just snorting away while I'm filming my videos. If you guys do enjoy this video, then please don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, that'd be much appreciated. And also guys, don't forget to go onto my YouTube page, go and click that tiny weeny little gray bell next to the subscribe button, and then you will ensure that you don't miss any more videos because that's rubbish and we don't want you to miss any more videos. It's sweating hot in my house right now. Whew. Uh, the first thing I'm going to talk about is this shirt from Zara. Um, it was, I believe, £15.99, which is dead cheap for Zara. I've never had anything from Zara before. And I went in and did this massive, like, shopping spree in there. And it was actually really, really reasonable. So this is just like a... Sh it comes down, obviously, you can't see the whole of it, but it kind of comes down to mid-thigh. It's like a schmock. A schmock? Smock? What's the word I'm looking for? I don't think it's schmock. <laughs> I think it's smock. <laughs> Like, it's like a painter's top, if you know what I mean. And it's got this tiny, weeny little silver ring in the middle, which is actually quite annoying, because you can see my bosoms through it sometimes, depending on how it falls, but oh well. And the only thing about this shirt is it easily, really easily gets makeup on the collar. You have to wash it quite often, but you don't want to wash it quite often, so my mum's having to, like, hand wash the collar every time I wear it. But other than that, I absolutely love it. The next thing from Zara that I want to talk to you about are these babies. These are so, so cute. And they're actually the first thing I picked up in there. Um, I was a massive fan of, like, the Creeper era, like, when Creepers were really, really in. Uh, I never actually had a pair myself because I, I, I didn't really feel like I could pull them off. But I think these are the next best thing. Like, they're elevated, they're silver, they're silver statement they're bold they're trainers which i love yeah they're quite difficult to walk in like not really difficult to walk in but you notice how sometimes like when you're in heels you roll your ankle that happens quite a lot in these but other than that they're brilliant shoes very comfortable and i think they were 39.99 from zara the only problem is i've scratched them up a little bit already the next thing i bought from zara is this shirt it's like one of those neck you can't you can't really hold it up very well it's like one of those neck ones where the neck's really low and it's got the thing going around here um again it's a bit like a, it's a bit it's a bit like a like a painter's shirt kind of thing that's really really in at the moment obviously it's check um so i really like that and this was 15.99 so good for zara um, I got it in a small because it's actually quite big even though I wouldn't usually get a small I don't think but it's quite oversized so I got it in a small. I haven't actually worn it yet so but when I tried it on I loved it. The next thing I'm going to talk to you guys about are these. These don't actually match the top that I just showed you. These are actually black and white. The other thing was navy and white. Check. Uh, but these are really really cool. Again from Zara. I tried them on in a size, what's this? I tried them on in a size small, uh, but I kind of struggled to get it done up over my bum. So I got them in a medium and they're quite like tight fitting, they're slim fitting things. Um, and these were, I think these were like 24.99. Uh, again, really, really good. I'm really, really happy with all of this stuff that I'm getting from Zara, but I, look a bit like a painter. The next thing I got from Zara is this shirt. Now don't be, f I know you guys can't see all of it, but it's really, really long shirt. So it's short at the front and it goes really long, like a cape down your back. And I saw it and I loved it. Again, it's that like shirt painter look, like smock, schmock, whatever it was that I was trying to say. It's a bit out there. I got it in a small because it's really oversized and this was 39.99, I tried it on. And I loved it, but to be perfectly honest, I would probably wear it with heels most of the time, just because it's so long, I don't want it to make me look short and stumpy, so I want it to make me look tall, you know what I mean? So I'd probably wear this with heels, which takes me on to my next item that I want to talk about. Oh my god. These are my new boots. These aren't actually from Zara, these are from Topshop, because this is a Zara and Topshop haul. 
Um, but I'm just going to mix and match showing you because I just needed to show you these. Uh, these were £60 uh, and they are just my life. They're not the most comfortable things to walk in but obviously look at them they're obviously not going to be the most comfortable things to walk in but i love them so much so the next thing i'm going to talk to you guys about is this little outfit this so they're the they're the trousers and then you've got the top here i've worn this a few times now and it is so comfy it's like um the trousers are kind of like collops and they're high-waisted and then this is the jumper that goes over the top of it it's comfy you can dress it up you can dress it down um, I don't think this was very expensive. I got it in a medium because I kind of wanted it quite baggy, if you know what I mean. Um, and I think altogether it cost £50, the, the, uh, like the set. So I'm really happy with that. And I've been putting them with my silver trainers that I got from Zara. The next thing I got from Zara is this beautiful, hold on, back to front, jumper. And it's kind of got like, it has got sleeves, but the sleeves on the arms whatever don't actually close like they're it's really hard to explain and they've got these like little tie up knots halfway down the arms um and it's just really nice now we're coming into i keep covering my face and the lighting goes weird now we're coming into warmer weather i hope this will probably be really really good because you can just wear it over like a strappy top and if you get warm you can take it off and stuff like that that's only if I've got my sun body though. I won't be wearing strappy tops if I don't have my sun body this year. And the last thing I got from Zara. Did I get this from Zara? Yeah. The last thing I got from Zara is this. It's so annoying when I do hauls because you can't see the whole thing. This is like a top dress. Um, and I absolutely love it. Obviously you need to wear it over something because it's completely netted. This was... This is a size small. Again, they're... They're in with the baggy stuff in Zara at the moment. Um, so I got it in a size small. It's really lovely material. I have worn it once. Oh no, I've worn it twice. I wore it with jeans and like a top. And then I also wore it with like a, a tight maxi dress. Not a maxi dress because it only comes up like to my thigh. But you know what I mean. So moving on to the top shop bits. I know I've already shown you my heels, but I just had to get them in. I got these leggings. Um, they're the top shop own leggings. They're really nice material. They're quite thick, so they're not like like bloody tight, so you can see every nook and cranny through them. Uh, these were twelve ninety nine, and I got them in a size eight. I love the band around the top because it reminds me of Calvin Klein, but it's not Calvin Klein. Like I think top shop is established enough now to have their own band if you know what i mean like calvin klein i think they're wicked i wish i picked up more pairs to be honest they did them in like other colors as well the next thing i got from top shop is this top cute but psycho obviously these tops are really in at the moment with just the little things on the front like the little offensive things you know what i mean i got this in a size medium because again i like them to be quite baggy this was 16.99 but i vowed i will not wear it until i have just sort of lost a tiny little bit of weight not like loads but like just get a little bit slimmer and that's when i'm gonna wear it probably be out of fashion then the next thing i got is another one of those t-shirts but it says fries before guys and I just, I have to say, I just totally agree with that. Guys, I'm really sorry the lighting keeps going funny. It's because I keep putting clothes in front of the light. Um, this was £16.99 as well, size medium. Again, won't be wearing it until I have my summer body. And the last thing I'm going to show you guys is this. This is like a bomber jacket with a hood. And it's netted inside. And it's copper. And it's beautiful. I completely forgot about it until I opened the bag. I got a size 16 for some reason. What happened there? Why did I get a size 16? That's really strange. I don't know why I do that. But I got it. It fits. So um, this was £50. It was £49.99 from Topshop. So it was quite pricey, but so worth it. You can just feel the material is amazing. And obviously... It will be something like the best. I won't be wearing it every single day. I also got some jeans and a jumper, guys. But the jeans are somewhere in my cupboard and I cannot be bothered to go and find them. And the jumper is in the wash because I've worn it so many times since I got it. But I'm going to end this video here, guys, because I really don't want to go on forever and bore you. I hope you enjoyed looking at all my new bits some pops like i said don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys really really soon bye